So number 12 then from the 2016 Advanced Science Maths. Here we go, the graphs question, four marks. But again, reduced just to this little transformations of a simple graph with the sole addition of the modulus sign. So part A for two marks. What would this be? Well, that just says you take this graph and you shift all the answers down C. So that means instead of crossing through negative C, I'll now cross through negative 2C. And by virtue of the fact that they're the same on both sides because the gradient's 1, it cuts at 2C here. So that, instead of cutting through at negative C, it goes down to negative 2C, which means this will also be 2C along. Make sure the distances are approximately the same or you might lose a mark. So the original graph would have looked like this after shifting down C, but what this wants is the modulus, which is the absolute value. So it's fine for this part, but this part would have to be flipped up. So instead of being 2C below, it'll be 2C above. Meaning that's the graph that they want, where you get one mark for having the two Cs and another mark for having the correct shape, which is this part reflected up. Now part B, what about the graph of the modulus of 2 times f of x? 2 times f of x simply means all the answers are twice as big as they were to begin with. So the only one that doesn't change is c, so it'll still cut through c. But instead of this being here, it would have to go down to negative 2c. So it'll still pass through c, but this graph would then have gone down through negative 2c as before meaning that is the graph of 2 times f of x, but what you want is the modulus of it, so this negative portion flips up here. And the marks are again, one for it cutting through 2c, another one for it being all above, still staying at c.